Good day guys and welcome back to Minecraft. Today we're going to be doing a build tutorial of one of my favorite tanks from the Warhammer 40k universe. So today should be kind of fun if you are wanting a very cool looking survival base or just want to build it for fun on a server. All I ask is to please provide credit and to provide credit, all you really have to do is take a sign. So type in design. <coughs> type in my name. Midnight Eclipse, type in built by, and then type in your name. That's all I asked for. Just put that somewhere into the build. It doesn't matter where. Um, for example, you could put it there. There. Or even there. <laughs> Uh, it doesn't really matter. So, uh, this is the building, well, the tank that we're going to be building. This is the Land Raider from uh, Warhammer 40k. And this is the tank that I'm going to show you guys how to build. And I'm also going to be showing you how to build various different sponsons. Uh, different mounts for the top. So let's get to it. All right, so to start off, you're going to want your dark oak slabs, your dark oak wooden stairs, your dark oak wooden planks, your block of iron, your cobblestone slab, your cobblestone wall, your observer, the trap door, and the wall. If you're in the survival, you're not going to have access to the observer, I don't think. Uh, if that is the case, wherever I put the observer, just put in a uh, block of iron. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is take down your iron blocks. Count down nine. Put down two more iron blocks. And that's going to be 14 back. So you're just going to fill that and do the same on the other side. Alright, fly back down to here. Alright, so starting here. You're going to be putting a top slab of the whatever block you're using and you're going to count every other block. Not there. And that's going to be on both sides. Alright, so next, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to place a block there. Well, your stair there, your stair there, your stair there. Then you're going to want to come on the inside. Place a stair, place a stair, place a stair, place a stair, 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 stair. And because we don't want to see this, we're going to take out the block, put down the block, and place that. And that's step one done. Okay, next up, you're going to want to bring this out by one on both sides. And I do apologize for all the uh, breaks in the video. I am going back and forth to check on that over there to make sure I'm doing everything correctly for you guys. Okay, so 
next off, you're going to want to come back here. And again, one out. Next, you're going to want to fill this up with your uh, blocks. Again, whatever material you're using, you could be using cobblestone, uh, stone bricks, your woods. Personally, I like using the dark oak, at least in this resource pack, or the purple blocks. It would look like that for your vehicle. But for this video, we're going to use the dark oak blocks as it will look better if you're using the vanilla resource pack. You want something that is dark, has stairs and slabs. All right, next off, you're gonna want slab there, slab there, slab there, slab there. And this is your front of the vehicle. Over on the back, you're gonna want stare. A stare. <laughs> Not like that. Not like that. Alright. Okay, so counting back from here, you're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six. And then you're gonna have a slab. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Same from the other side. All right, so that's that. Okay, so this side is very easy. Uh, you're just gonna fill this up. All right, so stair, stair, stair. On to the back side, you're gonna do block, block, block. And stair here, stair here. Upside down stair. And upside down stair. Okay, so on the back, you're gonna come out by two and go out by two on either side. So when you're done, you should have a five by two area of cobstone slab. All right, so around that, you're just gonna put in some blocks of the material you're using. So it should look like that. Okay, so from this block right here, you're gonna go back by nine. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's your block nine and it should line up right with that part of track. All right. Okay, so, my bad. Replace this block right here with your upside down stair. Now you're gonna count out two to either side of that. And in behind those two stairs that you just placed down, you're gonna come in with your blocks by two. And onto the sides of those, you're gonna do an upside down stair. There we go. So you should have this so far. All right, so what you're gonna do is on these here, you're gonna do one, two, three. And I've messed something up. All right, so I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I'm back and I figured out what I did. So this entire front section actually needs to move forward by one. <laughs> okay. All right, so now it should be correct if you've moved your entire front section up by one. You did not move the tank tracks at all because those were fine. All right, so you should have three, a space of one, and then three more. And repeat that until you get to the middle beam. And the same for the other side. And 
for the minimum beam, you just fill in that with your blocks. And you should have that. Okay, I'll be back. All right, so next layer, again, at by one. Now you're gonna do a stair and two back to your blocks. Same with the other side of this, two back. And you're gonna do the same on this side here. Two blocks of iron, stair, stair, upside down stair, by the way. Uh, two blocks, two blocks, okay. All right, so take your wool. You're gonna have two wool there. Two wool there. Blocks and blocks. Just fill that in and leave this open for now. Uh, you're just gonna go ahead and fill that up like so. So you should have that. And then off of the here, you're gonna do stair and then upside down stair. Stair and upside down stair. You should have that. All right, so you're just gonna fill this up with two by four. Then behind that, you're gonna do a row of five. So one, two, one, two, two, one, two. So four and five. So you should have a gap of two. All right, so now from going here, should be two, two, two. So you should be three by two. Same with the other side. So you should have that. All right, so once you have that, you can have another five. All right, so once you have that five, you're gonna do a three by three block. It should be three, three, and three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. And then you're gonna have a four. Two, three, four. That's five. That's four. One, two, three, four. So you're gonna have that. And these little outcroppings are gonna be areas to have your seats. Or if you're doing this in survival, you could have them full of crafting tables, furnaces. Uh, anvils, you name it. <laughs> All right, so then you're gonna have another four, and then the upside down stair. So four, upside down stair. Okay, so half slab, two half slabs. That's what you should have. So once you have those three half slabs in, you're gonna take your cobblestone wall, put two there. Now coming onto the back of this, you're going to do a row of five. And not like that. Like that. Okay. Now on the back of that five that you just placed, you're going to do two. Upside down stair. Two. Okay. So you're going to take your comes to the wall. Two out. Two out. So it should look like that. That's what you want. Then upside down stair, upside down stair, blocks of iron. Upside down stair, upside down stair, two blocks of iron. All right, so before we go any further, there's a couple little small details we need to take care of. So down here, you're gonna take your levers, two there, two there. Two on this side as well. And over here, uh, again, two. And two. These are your little connectors that connect the tracks together just to make it look a little nicer, you know? All right, so inside, you're going to have your black shulker box. Two there. If you are using vanilla, um, use trapdoors here. Because in vanilla, I will show you.
in vanilla, it's going to look like this. You don't want that. It's not going to look nice. So if you are using vanilla, use your trapdoors. Or the alternative of what you could do is place two angels. Alright, so now that we have that out of the way, take your stone and a half slabs. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Alright, so now come out to here where you have this section right here coming right along this stair. On the outside, upside down stair. Upside down stair. Half slab, two halves, or well, three half slabs, and then half slab. This is going to be the beginning of your uh, sponson. And you're going to do the same over here. Upside down stair, upside down stair, half slab, three half slabs, one half slab. So it should look like, so it should look like this, and you're done with this floor. Alright, next level. You're going to have two iron blocks there, two iron blocks there. Stairs and stairs. That is the end of the going up section. We will start going back in. Alright, so on the back of this, just two, 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 and two. Or you could just say four and four. And that's all you need to do is that. All right. So you're going to bring this up by two. You're going to put those there. So it should be <laughs> like that. Two. 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 And then you're going to bring these up. Side. Upside. All right, once you have those done, just on front of this uh, upside down stair, put one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This creates your entryway. All right, where you're, you have these two blocks, take one, two out, stair this way, stair this way. Same with here. Stair, stair. Alright. So, let's go ahead and put this here for now. Open those. This creates your backpack and your gun rack. Alright, so in behind that, you're going to put two iron blocks. And you're just going to fill that up. And on this side, you're just going to fill it up with your block. No iron blocks or shulker boxes or gates on the side. All right. So you need to bring that out by one, that out by one. And stack that up by one. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So that should be six in total. This creates your secondary door. All right, so one, two, three, one, two, three. On the other side, one, two, three, one, two, three. And while we're at it, okay.
Next, what you want is stair, stair. Bring these all the way out. And these all the way out. Then three, 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 three. Should be a little bit of a gap there. If there isn't, then you have it too far out. All right, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Should look like that. All right, so after having those four, you should have one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so after you have those, one, two, three, four. Upside down stair, one, two, three, four, five. Upside down stair, one, two, three, four. And for these, just cover these up until you get to that. Actually, yeah, just till you get to there. Then upside down stair, upside down stair. And you guessed it, iron blocks. Upside down stair, upside down stair. Iron block. No, that's not right. Iron blocks. There we go. And while you're at it, grab your levers. Put two there. And two there. Alright. Alright, so now that you have that, one, two, three. And trapdoor. Then you're going to bring your cobblestone stair up here and here. All right, so on here, you're going to have cobblestone wall, cobblestone wall, iron block, observer, or if you don't have them, just iron blocks. Or if you want to do it like what I currently have, try to get this to the big gear, if it'll work for you. Okay, it's directional. Okay, let's do with that for now. And your skull goes there. Alright. Do believe that's it for this floor. Nope, I am wrong. Alright, so over here. You're going to want your upside down, well, your tops. Yeah, just your slab. Fill these up with your cobblestone wall. Again. And then fill that up. Cobblestone wall, cobblestone wall. Slab, slab. Cobblestone wall. So this here creates the appearance of indents for walking up the side of the tank. Okay, yeah, that's it for this floor. On to the next level. Alright, so for this level. I'm going to do iron blocks here. And two, two, out there. There you go. Then, stair, stair. That way, then that way. All right, once you have that down, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And upside down stair. Upside down stair. Okay, so once that's done, you're gonna want to come over here. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ow. Remove that one, put it there. There we go. Bring these two out, and these two out. Alright, so, once you have that, upside down stair, upside down stair, half slab. There's your doorway. Yes, it is only two and a half tall, but that is how tall it needs to be. 
And if you are doing this in survival and using the conquest resource pack, you could have a doorway. That's this. Not beautiful, but it works. All right. Okay, so this time, just fill that up. Bring these out by three again. You do not put the uh, cobblestone walls on this time. You do, however, put these slab. Bring this out by four. And do the same over here. So three, three, two, 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 four. No cobblestone walls. Half slab. And three. Well, two, two, two. Two, two, and two. All right. So cobblestone walls there. Cobblestone walls there. Let's go ahead and grab our dark oak fence. One there. Ugh, not fence. Or, er, not gate. I meant fence. There we go. One, two. So that should look like that. Okay, so once you have that, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, bring these out by two. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, bring them out by two. Okay, yes, I thought so. So just fill all of this up. All of it. There we go. Should look like that. Cobblestone walls. Skeleton. Upside down stairs, upside down stairs, upside down stairs, upside down stairs. Again, iron blocks and iron blocks. And levers. Okay, that's that part done. All right, so observer, three cobblestone wall. Half stone slab. Well, not half stone slab. Your normal slab that you're using on both sides. Alright, so once you have that, two, 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 one, two, two, two. You should have that. Once again, grab your white wool and we want to make this design. After you have that, slabs, top slabs, that is, all up and along here, just one row behind, and one right there. So once you have that, take your levers and flip them facing towards the iron block. There we go. Now you're done with this floor. On to the next one. Alright, starting off. Iron blocks, iron blocks. Half slab. Iron blocks on top of these. By half slab. Well, we still have our levers in our hand. Put two there. Put some blocks all the way up and along the back here. Same on 
the other side. Alright, so blocks all the way up along. Up until you get to here. Stair, stair, iron blocks. Stair, stair. My mind just did a flip. Stair, iron blocks, stair. Okay, so once again, fill all this. Be like that. All right, so over here, count two back for the block. And bring that all across. And put a stair, a stair. So it should be space, stair, and three spaces, stair, space. Okay, forgive me. That's actually stair, then your block. Hang on. Remove what you just did. Stair, block, stair, on the front of that block, then three stairs, put a block, and a stair on the front, and a stair on the side. That is what you should have. Okay, then you put your blocks on the back. There we go. And you're going to bring this all the way back until you get to here. Then replace this block and the glowstone. Count three. One, two, three. And glowstone. Like that. And then stair, 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 stair on the sides of the glowstone that are still visible. So underneath, you should have that. All right, so count two back from that glowstone. One, two. Then everything else is just putting blocks for now. We'll switch out whatever we need to later. Okay, so you should have that. Count one, two, three. Okay, so these here replace with your gates and replace all this with just nothing. <laughs> just remove them. Then under here, you're going to have a stair. Stair. Remove the rain. We don't want that. Okay. So, if you couldn't see because of the rain, so you had that, you're going to put a stair on that. It's going to be upside down. And then you're going to put your gate there and your gate there and you're going to remove these all right so that's what you should have for the back here so once you have that over here you're going to put an upside down stair and upside down stair if hang on before i say that uh, let me just double check again Okay, let it up check. You're going to need a block here and a block here. And then you're going to fill everything else up with your half slots. Okay, so let's come back on inside and just double check and make sure everything looks good. This is what we have. Yeah. Yeah, put blocks there. There we go. Yeah, that looks right. That's your interior done. Okay. 
All right, so now back on the outside, we're gonna fill that up to the top here on all sides. Another slab, some more cobblestone walls there. Upside down stairs here. So it should look like that. So two, and upside down stairs. So slab, three slabs, and slab. Should look exactly like the bottom one that you made. We're eventually going to cut a hole out in the middle there. You can do that now or you can do that later. Okay, let me just double check to see if the front needs anything, which it probably does. Okay, so... Yeah, let's do this side first. Grab your wool. Two pieces right there. Okay, so once you have your wool there, come on to the other side over here. Take your skull, put one skull there, and your cobblestone wall there. And that's done for that. Okay. Okay, so. Uh, for this, just do that for now. And... You have it done on the other side. All right, so this time we're gonna be starting on the back because it'll be a little bit easier. So stair, 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 iron blocks, iron blocks, lever, and lever. Okay. Okay, count 11. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 9, 10, 11. That is correct. You are now covering that with a block. Same with the other side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There we go. Okay. After that, half slab and half slab. Okay, so same thing on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Half slab, half slab. Fill these up. Just up there. You don't want to go any further than that. All right. Grab some glowstone. And just fill that up like that. This is, so it's like the same you did for the iron here, but just with glowstone. Okay, so the glowstone that I said to put here, replace those with your wood. And then with your trap doors, you're just going to place them up and on top like so. You should just have the front of that glowstone revealed. And the reason why you don't have your glowstone here is because you can't have your trap doors on the side of this. It just looks kind of funny. All right. Okay, so one block back from this block here, I'm gonna put stair, 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 stair. So you should have four in total. Okay, then what you wanna do is just one block back, another block back, and then connect that to the other tracks. And this gives you your little platform for the gun mount. And back here, you're going to take your gates and just, again, three. 
and you're actually going to have two rows of that this time. And then over here, you're going to have your stair. And fill everything up with just your block. Nice easy step. Nothing to it. Alright, we already have our levers there. Alright. Believe it or not, that's that level already done. And your tank should look like this so far. All right, next layer. All right, back on the front, you're going to take your half slabs. You're mostly just gonna be using half slabs on this floor. And two, one, and just bring that all the way back. Take it here, and two, and then one. Fill these up. And same on the other side. Two, one, and then all the way back. Take it that spot. Put two there, just behind the iron blocks. Make sure there's a space there, and a space there. Fill everything else up. Okay, now we get to take care of the middle part. And that's where the hard part on this floor comes in. Okay, so count four back. One, two, three, four, then one, two, three, four, five, six in. Should give me something seems wrong. I'll be right back. Okay, yes, something was wrong. Remove these. And move it back by one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Then your cobblestone walls. So it should be a pattern like that. Your blocks are on that. Okay, there we go. And then you should have a half slab there. Okay. Alright, so right behind this, you're just gonna layer one that directly behind it. So a full row of half slabs going from track to track. After that, just leave it as it is for now. And I'll be right back. Okay, so now we need a five by three block. One, two, three, four, five, then three, then back by five and three. So fill up those two, leave that empty, grab any color wool, put it there. That's just going to be a marker to let you know that your weapon mount needs to be right there. Just for your convenience. Okay. Then uh, over by three, this becomes one, and I like that. Okay, so I thought I made a mistake. I didn't. Uh, one, two, three. Place that there, two there, one there, place one there. Bring this back. Hang on though. Leave that there. Two back, one there. And one there, one there, one there. Okay, so yeah. You should have this shape once you're done with that. So at the end you should have one, two, back in by one. Uh, back in another one, I have a block, I have a half slab, come diagonally up, half slab, then three over with your block, then half slab, then diagonally out with half slab and make that a two, then diagonally over and have a one half slab. And you should be where I am. Okay. Good.
All right, so let's place that with a block of iron. Put a half slab onto that. That creates that little. Uh, not sure what they call that, to be honest. But it's pretty much a um, hatch that you can come up and out of. And the actual design is not really anywhere to come through inside here. <laughs> I suppose if you really want to, you could try and make that line up. Not really sure how you would do that. I'm actually going to see here. So if we come down. Okay, so that's going to be right on top of that. So if you really want to line that up, you could put a ladder in here instead of having this. All right. Anyways, that's that section of the tank complete. We now get to move on to the Bonsons and the uh, armaments. If you made it this far, and I know it couldn't have been easy, what, with this being my first build tutorial, give yourself a pat on the back. You definitely deserve it. Congratulations on making it this far. Let's get you some nice weapons on here. Alright, so the first armament that I'm going to show you guys how to build is this piece right here. Get your nice uh, <laughs> cannon with a bulldozer like blade on it. So if you want to have this on your tank, alright, so first off, you want to remove all this. Give yourself a nice open area to work with. And replace all these with blocks. Turn that upside down stair in the block. Let's add another layer there. Okay. So, stairs. Hang on. No. Yeah, stairs on that. So, you should just have that. And then stairs. Then you have another row of stairs. Okay, once we have that, and come back by three, make a nice O shape, <laughs> barrel. Let's just run that back by two more. Okay, so you should have a barrel. Next thing you want to do is you want to come in and onto the side, have a stair like that. Same on the other side. Stair, and stair, just so that you can get that. So you want to just be that far in. Blocks, blocks. Place this block with a stair, replace this one with a stair. And have a stair. A stair. It's another stair here and here. Put a block behind that stair and block behind that stair. So two, then one, two, then one. And fill those in with blocks in behind it, remove these, and replace them with your blocks, 
And then just in behind here, you're going to have a block. Keep that. Block. I accidentally got rid of mine. Keep that there. And just bring your hand slaps right back. And that gives you your, your cannon. Let's just fix this up a little. So bring this forward. Stick. Make stairs diagonally. Replace that one with a stair. And replace everything behind it with just blocks. Just makes it nice and smooth for you. Have a half slide. Okay, there's your cannon. Now let's make the blade. Okay, so counting from here, you're gonna go one, so from there, and from directly beside that, counting by one, so now you have two, three, four, five. Bring that forward by one, we don't want it to touch the blade. Yes, let's go six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so stair, skip one, stair, skip one, stair. And same on the other side. And in those spaces, just fill it up with blocks. And on the end of those, stairs. Okay, so behind this stair here, pull your block, bring them all in behind, and place a block. And with your cobblestone wall on every other block. Alright, so again, just on top of the last one. This time, instead of putting cobblestone stairs, block, 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 and half slabs. Now we're back here because we have the cannon. We don't want that to be too low, so remove these. Put in your stairs. We should have that. Then once again, just on top, up until you get to the stair, leave a gap, go to the next stair, and on top. So we have these little areas right here. Put an upside down stair. Upside down stair, then cobblestone wall in the gap that we just created. Okay, so now, just on top of these four, you want to have your blocks one, two, three, four, then your half slabs one, two, three, one, two, three, and time for the last layer, which is just one, two, one, two, block. That's the cannon done. We just need to connect it up. So for your connection, just bring out some iron bars, some iron bars. Well, not your iron bars, but your iron blocks. An iron block there, two there. One there. Remove that stair. Bring your iron blocks. Iron blocks. Iron block. And there you go. There's your cannon. On this version, you do not have an interior. And for this, because there's just the open hole, just take your black wall, put it right on the end. There you go. You're done. Okay. 
Now to show you guys how to build the sponsons, I'm just going to go ahead and revert this back to how it was. Alright guys, so I'm back. And we're going to go ahead and uh, place this sponson here right onto it. So I've marked out where we actually need to begin. So the first block isn't going to go here, the second block is going to go down here by the stair. Or on the stair, actually. So, first step, remove this. Okay. Next. We're going to want to have slips. One, two. One, two. And three. And bring that out as blocks. There we go. Okay, let's bring that by up by two. One, two. And start. Then back by two. Next is block and block. And bring those out by three. Then have a stair and a stair. And on this, we're going to have a stair and an upside down stair. And on this side, we're just going to fill that up with blocks. And a cobblestone wall. Cobblestone wall. Then blocks. And for those of you who are using Conquest, you use your white shulker boxes followed by your iron blocks those who are using vanilla go ahead and uh, so these two blocks here for you in vanilla would be black wool then anvil and anvil. Bring your cobblestone wall out by four. And half slab, half slab, half slab, and half slab. And have your constant wall there. Have your red glass there. And your trap doors. And you're done with the uh, <laughs> old style Laz Cannon gun sponson. That's really all there is to that one. So, yeah, three <laughs> and two. Okay, so for your more traditional gun sponsons that are recognized by the more modern uh, version of this game. 
you can start off with building your four tall cobblestone pillar. Have your red stained glass here. And again, trapdoors all over this. Flip them down. All right, now we can build off of this. Okay, so for this one, we're going to start off with iron blocks there, iron blocks there, followed by your cobblestone wall. And then the cobblestone wall, cobblestone wall. Now on the front, you're going to have cobblestone wall on that. Grab yourself any block, place two down there. And have your fence, your fence, and fence, and again, fence. Have your trap doors. Just fill them up on these. And a couple on the top. on the bottom and now you have your hailstorm uh, <laughs> bolter it's a very easy spawn since built <laughs> it's just been months since I've built the designs <laughs> So I am a bit rusty with how I built this entire tag, <laughs> as you can clearly see by how many edits were done on the video, and I do apologize for that. <laughs> it's just been so long since I've done this. We've only got one more to go. Thank you so much for holding out, and I hope that you enjoy your tag. We just have the double lies cans to... Uh, build. So for each uh, <laughs> gun spawns, and all you have to do is just repeat what you did on the last side. So if you could just rewind in the video and build the exact same thing, just in reverse. So if I'm building this side, you're putting it on this side. If that makes sense. So, you'd instead of having these here, you would have them on this side. And then these here be on this side as it would all be flipped. Yeah, if that makes sense. I hope it does. Okay. On to the next weapon. All right, so we're back down to this. We don't need to go back through on how to do this, as that would still be there. <laughs> and if you skipped through the video to get to the last cans, uh, again, it's just four pillars up, block of stained glass, fill it with or cover it with. Uh, trapdoors and you're back to where we are okay starting off because I have to keep people who are building in survival in mind start off with your stone slabs and this is why I <laughs> did this so for those of you in survival, 
you're going to have anvils on here. And with the slimes already here, they do not just drop on you. Those of you using Conquest. You'll be using your white stained shell curve boxes. Just make sure that you get them in the right direction. There we go. Then you have your block of iron, followed by a block of iron on the other side as well. And go out by four with your cobblestone wall. One, two, three, four. And the last thing to do, just cover these with your trapdoors. Now, uh, before I end this, there is one thing I forgot to do on <laughs> both of the Hellstorm Cannon version and the last Cannon version. Yeah. Put a stair there. There you go. Now you're done. Okay, so we've got a radar dish to build, a gun to build, and a missile pod. Let's start off with the radar dish. Okay, so for this, all you're going to need is your lever, your block of iron, your dark oak fence, and your iron bars. First things first. Let's get our iron block up into the air. You can have one lever there, flip it that way, and one that lever there, and there you go. So now we've got a nice little connector here. Okay, so you're going to have your fence here. One bar up. Go out by two. And go out by two. That's all there is to your uh, radar ditch. In fact, yeah, uh, let's cut that up down by one. Yeah, that looks better. <laughs> Just have a small one. So now we're going to build the gun spawns. And this, you're going to need your cobblestone wall, your blocks, your stairs, your slab, and your gates. Alright, so block, 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 block. Have a plus symbol. And fill the corners in with your cobblestone walls. Okay, then off this cobblestone wall, you have a stair, followed by an upside down stair. Same with the other side, so stair, upside down stair. Fill the half slab, put a half slab in the middle, remove that one. Your two blocks of iron, followed by two cobblestone, your half slab, and your fence gate. And there you go, you have your uh, gun spawn, <laughs> your gun mount.
Looks pretty cool if I don't say so myself. I kind of like this version. But, for all due intents and purposes for the tutorial, I do have to remove this now. Okay, so now on to the missile pods. Okay, so for the missile pods, go to replace that with that. Go up by one. So you want an L. <laughs> with your trapdoors, you want to go one back, two in front, and two off the side. Same with the other side. Two in front, one in back, two to the side. Okay, so then you want your stairs and stairs. Cover the rest of this with your blocks. Not there. Leave those two empty. You're going to place your heads. <laughs> And if you have just a plain red texture head that you know of and uh, know how to put in, use those. Or you could have white as well. Just preferably not a mob head. <laughs> uh, unless you have a certain character that you'd like to fire out of a cannon, I guess. <laughs> I kind of feel sorry for this guy now that I think about it. That really went dark, okay. Anyways, moving on. So, two out of the middle. Except it's not up there. Down here. There you go. That's that layer. Okay. Then stairs up along here. Stairs up along here. Fill that. Some more heads. Fill that with a block. So fill that up with block, upside down stair, blocks, and the last thing to do is just cover this with trapdoors. The only place that you're not going to put a trapdoor is directly in the middle. There you go. And that's your uh, missile <laughs> turret. Okay. That everything now? Uh, no, no, it's not. Okay, okay. So for this turret, you're gonna have two cobblestone walls. Make sure that's one away from there. Put one on top of the back one here. Then you're gonna have an iron block behind both on diagonally. We're going to have a string down here. This is to prevent the anvils from falling. Uh, 
Okay, flex your anvil and your anvil. Uh, again, more iron blocks just in front of that. And then three cobblestone in front of these. Grab yourself a red stained glass pane. Not block this time, just pane. And that's going to go right in between the two iron blocks right there in the front. And you're going to have your upside down stair in between the two iron blocks in the back. And then the upside, or just regular steps on top of the cobblestone wall and the pane. Then you're going to have your trap door. We'll add another trap door. Two on the back, one on the front. You're going to have your uh, levers on the back of those iron blocks. Then you're going to have your trap doors on the sides. Flip them down. Same with the other side. There you go. And that's your tank done. You, with each weapon showing how to build. Okay. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Because this took so, quite a few hours to uh, put together. Alright. So I do hope you guys had a great day. Enjoyed building this. And look forward to more builds for me. Uh, this last bit that I'm doing is just something that I'm messing around with at the very moment. Uh, you don't actually have to do this. That's not even going to stay. Yeah.